The Scottish Feminist Judgments Project is a project that asks how important cases from Scotland, legal cases, could have been decided differently if the judge had come at the case with a feminist perspective. So we're showing how, even with the law as it was and the facts as they were, in, in these cases the outcome could have been different or the reasoning might have been different. Yeah. And listening to you talk about all the different legal thinkers and campaigners that have been involved, yeah. in my view this had a huge impact yeah. on legal culture in yeah. Scotland. Uh, who, what types of people have you had involved listening to what you've been writing yeah. about? We've been, yeah, we've been blown away by how many people are interested. So we had some legal practitioners involved in the project from the beginning, so either writing a judgment or, or providing a commentary on one of the judgments. But as audience members, we've spoken to the Faculty of Advocates, we've spoken to the Law Society of Scotland, We've taken our um, artwork, because there's an artistic strand to the project too, to uh, the Scottish Parliament. We've spoken to the uh, legal uh, service at the Scottish Parliament as well. We've done workshops with students on uh, a bike tour that we did. Um, and we have come to events like this where we don't know who's in the audience. Maybe some lawyers, maybe not, but we want to speak to people beyond the legal profession too. But yeah, we've been really delighted with the, the interest in the project, both from lawyers and, and, and from beyond. Clearly, these judgments show that in the past and still today, there are obviously limits to how far, how progressive lawyers are with what they do. And I think what's been really encouraging for us has been, like I said, the uptake with lawyers, but also the effect on students. You know, we've worked with a lot of students who, are of course tomorrow's lawyers if they go on to practice law and they have really picked up this project and run with it that sparked their imaginations in ways that we hoped would be the case but even with those hopes they've been exceeded like we've had students come and have a go at rewriting portions of their own judgments um, producing creative responses and the feedback we receive from them is that they think they can use this project and what its lessons are in their in their studies and and hopefully beyond when they go on to impact uh, you know the world through the legal work that they do so we think it's you know there are signs of hope and we are really you know be delighted if the work we've done can act as a kind of um, inspiration for people uh, going forwards.